So here we are, our second video of the day. Very exciting. I have a guest class with me today. So everybody say hi. Hi. Okay. Some of you are asking why we're not doing trig and not doing trigonometric identities. I have Mr. Zhang in the back wondering why we're not doing calculus, but he's being very patient. Uh, today, I feel really lucky. So we're going to talk about perimeter, right? So what did we get last time on perimeter? What did we figure out it was? Uh, no, no, no. Last time we figured out that perimeter is always what? Look at your notes. I'm sure you wrote it down, didn't you? What do we call this side right here? L. Nice job. L. We call this side? L. L because it's the same size. This side we called? W. w. And this we called? W. w. And we said let perimeter be the letter P. And it's equal to what? No, 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 no. We're not doing it right. I, I'm with you and I'm really proud of you. But I don't care about the numbers because if I always know how to do it, then it won't matter what the numbers are. Isn't that right? Yep. It's, ooh, you said L times W, and we talk, L times W gives us what? Does it give us the perimeter, or does it give us the, gives us the area, right? If we did L times W, then we'd get this stuff inside here, wouldn't we? Good, that's all right. So how do we get perimeter? Perimeter, remember we walked the chihuahua around, and something horrible happened with the bus. And I'm sure he's going to be fine. Yes, Max. Well, we do. We do length plus width time um, plus length plus width. So we do this plus that plus this plus that plus this, and we total it all together, right? So how would you write that? How many L's do we get? Two. So we get two L plus what? Nicely done. So what is L in this case? Twenty-two. So we get this two is this one, is that all right? Times 22 and 1 fourth, holy macaroni, plus 2 times 17. 2 times 17 is 34. Good job. I know the show must go on, Sep, so, right? 34. But what is this mess? We could do it this way, couldn't we? We could do 22 and a quarter plus 22 and another quarter. What's 1 fourth plus 1 fourth? Be careful. Ew, what, how come somebody might say, not you, but how come somebody might say uh, two-eighths? It's not right, but why Why might somebody say that? What would they think? Oh, oh, because you don't add the That's right, you don't add the numbers. But what has to be true about the denominators? Uh, they have to be the same. They be the same. And they are. So how many fourths do we get? Two-fourths. Two two-fourths two is the same. Good one job. Half. Good job. One-half. And two plus two? No, it's not a, golly, you guys, really, seriously? It's embarrassing. Just kidding, fella. <laughs> look, look, we said four. I know you said four, but this is a video. It's got to be funny. Thank goodness these people can't see you. Nicely said, sir. And two plus two is four. So the total perimeter is 44 and a half. So if you walked your chihuahua, whose name is Roman. <laughs> Hey, this time he must live. Let's find an interesting color. If we walk that chihuahua from here to here, that'd be 17. 17 plus this, 22 and a quarter, plus 17 more, plus 22 and a quarter. If we added all that together, if we walk the dog that whole area. Let me see if I can draw a dog. I'm pretty sure I can. Here's a dog. There's a dog right there. That's his tail. And there's his. It's like a duck. <laughs> It's a bird dog. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. So if we walked this little fellow all the way around here and didn't get him hit by a bus, he would have walked a total of that distance, wouldn't he? Yeah. Perimeter, right? Okay. If you haven't already subscribed, please do. And if you're wondering why I'm doing these videos, because it's fun. All right, you guys. Good work.